YouTube Red. You may have heard of YouTube Red. Maybe you got it in your inbox. <clears throat> you may not have heard of YouTube Red. You may be a YouTuber. You may not be a YouTuber. But basically what YouTube Red is, is it's a pay prescription for YouTube. I think it's like $10 a month. <clears throat> you get to watch YouTube ad free. Now, that seems like a good idea to a lot of people. A lot of people already watch YouTube ad free. And there are several ways to do it. I don't watch YouTube ad free. I'll tell you why I don't watch YouTube ad free. I don't watch YouTube ad free because I know people invest their time, their energy, and their hard earned money making videos. Now the majority of us do this because we love you, we love what we do, we love interacting with people, we love putting our opinions on the internet <clears throat> for our friends and fans to watch. Now some of us, a long time ago when it was a prestigious honor to get it, we worked really hard to get what they call a partnership, which means we get to display ads on our video. A couple years ago, they just made it where you didn't have to build your channel up so big and become so popular to get ads on your video. We make a little extra revenue off that ad. It's no secret. Nobody, everybody knows if an ad runs on a video, somebody's getting paid somewhere. Now, just because of ads running on my video doesn't mean <clears throat> I'm necessarily getting paid. Because a lot of times I do cover tunes. Uh, I upload songs that are, you know, basically me playing somebody else's song. The robots understand that. They, they catch it and go, hey, you're uploading a cover tune, right? And of course I tell it, yes, I am. Because I'm not going to try to make money off somebody else's work. So the ad that runs on that video goes to the original artist. But anyway, I kind of stray away from what I'm looking, talking about here a little bit. YouTube Red is this new thing. YouTube Red, people like Tobuscus, Ray William Johnson, uh, Philip DeFranco, people like that. They're going to keep making their cushy big money. People like Boogie2988, 2988, my bad, you know, Francis guy, Francis Rage's guy. Him, a few other people. Probably the Anger Grandpa, which that show sucks anyway, but probably them, a few other people. They're kind of sitting back right now wondering what's going to happen. Because if ads don't play on their videos, then they don't get paid. Now, some of these people make their living doing this. Some of these people, this is all they do. They don't have real jobs. I have a real job. I do this for fun. A little bit of money comes in here and there, and it helps to buy equipment and things like that. But these other people, I have skills to do a real job for now. One of these days, I may be too old. Getting close now. <laughs> but anyway. Some of these people that make a living off of YouTube, they probably, well, I can't say probably shouldn't, but, you know, they got that lucky break, are biting their fingernails right now. Some of them deserve to be biting their fingernails, some of them don't. Because if people start paying <clears throat> $10 a month to watch YouTube ad-free, and all that money's going to the big guys, like Ray William Johnson, Tobuscus and a few others, then that means these people that do it for a living aren't going to have a job anymore. Well, they can still do their job, they just won't get paid for it. Now, I'm not for or against YouTube Red, I could care less. The main point I'm trying to make in this video, and of course it took this long to get to, get to this point, like I said, earlier I watch YouTube with the ads on. <clears throat> I use a program called Adblock that blocks all the ads on the internet. I use it everywhere I go except for on YouTube. And the reason being is because I know 
somebody out there somewhere, maybe even you, made a video and you might make a few pennies off of it. Now a few pennies isn't much, but that's literally what we make if you're not a big timer. And that's a big video that makes a lot of hits, a few pennies. And that's not a lot. But when you consider some of these kids and guys and gals out there that don't make hundreds of thousands of dollars a year doing this or who don't have a really good job or just have a good job and have to struggle to make ends meet those few pennies add up now nobody likes to get on the internet and grovel talk about how bad their life is and boo 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 and you know give me money please I'm hurting but you know those ads just may have to keep some or just may keep somebody from having to do that so I watch YouTube I'll leave the ads on I'll leave the ads run because somebody somewhere has bought this camera has bought a laptop has bought a desktop tripods accessories memory cards phones <clears throat> adapters whatever it takes to get their video filmed to a computer uploaded and online now do I have anything against e begging not really if you need the money and other people have it to give it to you back away I don't mind people setting up um, those accounts not the GoFundMe's but there's there's accounts you can set up people have been telling me I should do it it's an account you can set up where people donate to you on a monthly basis if you want to donate dime nickel quarter dollar well it's probably not even that low it's probably dollar five dollars whatever you know whatever you think you want to help somebody out with and I'm not asking for that yes just like everybody else I've got a million things going on in my life got a lot of stuff going on that I could help use help financially with but oh well that's just the way it is I see a bum I hate to call them bums but I see a homeless person on the side of the street I give them money it's illegal in Florida if I give a bum <clears throat> damn I call him a bum again I give a homeless man on the side of the street $20 guess what I can go to jail I'm fined 50 bucks if a cop sees me do it but oh well I do it because if I have the extra twenty dollars on me and I can spare it I give it to them you now it's sitting every homeless person I see just happens to be when I happen to have the money and stop at a light but anyway you understand the point I'm trying to make right when you watch YouTube turn ad blocker off and I'm not just saying this is because of me there are a lot of youtubers out there like I said that make a living doing this and I know a lot of them that probably couldn't hold down a real job if they did get a real job so do what you want with YouTube Red do what you want with the internet do what you want with YouTube but I'm just asking you please when you watch people's videos turn that blocker off just if it's just on YouTube and like I said this isn't for me this is for everybody out there Everybody out there that's got a video monetized, give them the couple pennies. It doesn't come out of your pocket anyway. You know what I mean? Well, I'm Booty the Drunk Guitarist, and it's been YouTube Red.